Romans 5.13 says, Now may the God of hope fill you with joy, that you may in joy and peace in believing, that you may be abound in hope. Sorry for the wind, guys, by the way. Uh, very windy today. Gotta get my paper underneath the board. Sorry, guys. There. Hey, get my paper underneath the board, that way it doesn't blow away. Um, so, we live in a world with hatred and country. People hate each other, and in different countries hate each other, and so we're, we live in the night. You know, we are in, it's dark. You know, people live in the night. But we need to be living in the day. And that's not literally, that's just figuratively. Um, I'm not literally saying that everybody's sleeping in the daytime. I'm saying, you know, we're in, we are, we live in a dark world. We need to be in a world with light, a world with God. Uh... Jesus is the light. You know, the word of Christ is the light. You know, uh, us Christians, we need to be sharing the word of God. You know, we meet, we need to be telling people about it. We need to be that lighthouse. You know, to help the lost ships at sea get back into the bay, get back into shore, come back to shore. You know, that's that's what God called us to do. Is to be ministers. To be people that worship God, that minister to God, or minister, that minister for God. You know, ministries. So many people do it. Every, you know, this YouTube channel right here, ministry. Okay? Christian website that my friend started, that's a ministry. The Bible club I run at school, that's a ministry. You know, and then there's people that sit there, you have actual missionaries. You have your pastors, you have your music directors, music groups. All these people, they're all ministries. Okay? Uh, so, there's a couple things I want you to think about this week, okay? How can you minister to people? How can you be a witness of Christ? How can you witness to people? And how can you, uh, and are you, have, do you have joy in your life? Are you a happy person or are you a negative person? This is not for you, to, in the, like I say this in a lot of videos. You know, I'm, you know, you know, there's things in every single video that I put out where I'm trying to tell you guys about something, you know, helping you guys think about Jesus and growing as a Christian. It's not just stuff where I'm thinking, well, <laughs> these guys, you know, they don't do this, you know, they're all, they're all terrible Christians, no. Because guess what? Every single video that I've posted to help you guys grow as a Christian is areas that I need to grow as a Christian. It's not that I'm trying to point out all the negatives in your life and all that, no. You, me, or you guys, all you guys that have been saved, you're on the same journey as me. We're trying to grow as Christians. I'm putting pointers out there from what, you know, what I think would help grow as a, help me grow as a Christian, and what I think might help you guys grow as Christians. I'm putting that out there. And we're on the same journey together to grow as Christians and be closer to God than we've ever been before. Christians are all, all Christians should be on that journey. So, alrighty, so I will see you guys next week with our Sunday sermon.